The world of Twitter is trending with the keyword hair of God after Cristiano Ronaldo attempted to claim the goal scored by Bruno Fernandes. The goal was one of the two goals of the Portuguese team's victory over the Uruguay national football team held at Lozale Stadium. Cristiano Ronaldo fans, known to the militants, did not want to waste time providing full support. They even compared the act of the iconic Maradona to the World Cup's hand of God or the hand of God's hand. If seen in close-up, it does show Ronaldo's hair on the ball. Thus, many fans on Twitter were convinced that the goal belonged to Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes feels Cristiano Ronaldo is entitled to claim Portugal's first goal against Uruguay in the 2022 World Cup. Fernandes feels only to feed and see Ronaldo touching the ball before entering the net. FIFA recorded the goal as belonging to Bruno Fernandes. Meanwhile, there were also parties who felt Ronaldo was entitled to the goal. They believed there was a contact between Ronaldo's hair and the ball that was later dubbed, Hair of God. I celebrated as if it were Ronaldo's goal. I think it looks that Ronaldo touched the ball. My intention was to feed him, opens Fernandez quoted from the mirror. We re happy with the win earned, regardless of who s scored. The most important thing is that we reached our target which was to qualify for the next round, the Manchester United player resolved. Ronaldo in Portugal next match with his hair of God. Shameless. Ronaldo just produced another greatest moment in World Cup history. Hair of God. We still haven't been able to explain Maradona's hand of God, so we're certainly not ready to add Ronaldo's hair of God. Hand of God versus hair of God. No true Ronaldo fan will scroll without liking this hair of God.